Oh my god. Give it to me. Alright, what am I doing for this? I don't think that's it. Oh shit. That intense copyright. It says, <laughs> it says one of the known issues for this game is that Jake, the dog you play, his skin gets distorted. Jake's skin will appear increasingly, or no, I don't think it's Jake. I don't think that's Jake. This NPC, his skin will in appear increasingly distorted as areas within the game are explored. I want to see that. That sounds like a, a dope fucking bug. Some objects will appear blurred because of an offset. Offset. Excuse me, effect at a distance. Go to config. Video. Check enable. Um, half pixel offset. Too special. Now I have to remember that I'm making these changes because if Fatal Frame doesn't work tomorrow, then <laughs> if Ratchet Clank doesn't work tomorrow, then that's why. Oh, I want to say I love this fuck. Turn that off. I love this fucking. it is widescreen i love this fucking book shit all right who's ready for the best game you guys will ever see in your fucking lives you ready bitch look at that little chihuahua Oh my god, are you guys ready? Y'all got right on. Got right Hi, I'm Jake, and this is my life. No school, no chores. How cool is that? Ah, yes, it's great being a dog. Watch this. That's Daisy. Lately, she's been ignoring me. Well, we'll see about that. Oh, yes, she will be mine. Daisy? Ah, uh, it smells nice out here in the country, don't it, Dwayne? You cannot be serious, Dwayne. The country's full of bugs. <laughs> I'll be glad when we get to Lake Miniwawa. Wayne, can I play with them nice doggies? For pity's sake, Dwayne, are you nuts? They're full of terrible diseases. But I like doggies, Wayne. I told you no. <laughs> Oh, my head. What the? <laughs> no. What the fuck? Daisy. Oh, must rescue Daisy. Are you okay? But how? What's wrong with your textures? Hey, Jake. How's it hanging? Come on. A race to the top of the hill. Oh, brother. People are so insensitive. But I need to get back in shape. Oh, my God. I lay. I'm Daisy. keeping it. Hold on to your pants. Here I come. I'm keeping it. 
<clears throat> Eight yellows to play the P marking game. Hello? How do I get the dog to move? Oh, there we go. Look at him, he's black! That is another bug. But honestly, is it really a bug? Oh my god, when I fucking tab out of this game, it speeds up. Some games work without issue, and then some games suck and don't work without issue. I'm supposed to go... He has mold bacteria! Guys, chill, okay? That's not what you think. Alright, so... What do I do? I have to go into config, video, plugin settings. Here, I'll show you boys, because I know you care so much. Um, switch to software mode by setting renderer to any of the software options. Oh, God. Okay, well, fuck. All right, well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to turn this shit off. And what else did I change? We're going to... Okay, I need to change my settings back to... What they were for Fatal Frame and Ratchet Clank. Okay, and then I need to fucking record... Like, I need to... note what I fucking change so that when I uh oops when I play the other games that I can't remember right now I can go back to the settings because I don't think you can have profiles maybe you can but I haven't figured out how to do that yet I'm very new to this okay config emulation settings config Emulation settings. Uh, MTVU. Hit apply. Okay. Then we want to go to config video plugin. Maybe they're working on it. Who knows? All right, then I have to send re renderer. Oh my god, renderer to software or something? By setting renderer to any of the software options. So I guess I'll go with, excuse, excuse me, OpenGL software. Oh my god, and then it gets rid of all my settings? Is that a joke? What the fuck did I make these additional settings for? If they, oh no. Not like this, okay. Config, video, plugin settings, enable HW hacks. And then I had, what did I have? Half pixel offset to special texture. Half pixel. Offset special texture. Well, what the fuck is the point of doing that if you have to switch to software and it just invalidates all your fucking... Why are you still here? Switch to software. Um. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, it's fine. Let's see if this works better. Um, oh shit, wait, what did I have before? I had OpenGL, oh my god, please help me. I have, I had OpenGL, uh, hardware, right? That's what I had. Renderer, um, OpenGL hardware. <clears throat> okay. 
and then I have to make it software. Let's see if it works better now. Let's skip all this shit. I'm glad that I'm spending the time I'm spo- Oh! Are you okay? What are you doing? The time that I'm supposed to be relaxing on troubleshooting. I really just love being alive. Oop, it fell. It did indeed fall. It did indeed- Oh my god. Did you- If this isn't the ugliest game I've ever seen in my life. What do they do to it? Oh my god, the game's uglier and it- <laughs> Well, that didn't fucking fix anything. So that's incredible. So we're gonna go back and we're gonna go back to fucking hardware because... Duh. Um... And he's still black and patchy. Yeah, you're supposed to- it says- if you already oh it says okay switch to software mode by setting if you already played in hardware mode during a session any existing distortion will not get removed by switching to software so you have to start a new game basically why do I keep opening those you have to start a new game basically to fucking get it to not be like that but that's so ugly I mean okay maybe if we try um open maybe if we try uh, direct 3d 11 software it won't be disgusting maybe it won't be disgusting looking absolutely revolting looking all right let's try this again what is happening? Bro, software is just not working for me. Software is, software is not cooperating with me. You hate to see it. The logo has been drinking. Look at it. Software is not working for me, dog. Oh, you hate to see it. Excuse me. Is he still patchy? He's not patchy oh, yeah. anymore, but at what, what cost? <laughs> at what no. cost? Daisy. At what cost? Oh. The game looks Must like shit. It hurts Daisy. to look at it. But how? At what cost? Look at it. Hey, it's Jake? so How's pixelated. It it's on. like the eye grape. Oh, so look at but this. I need to get back in shape if I'm going to look for Daisy. Hold on to your pants. Here I come. Oh my god, there's no way. There's just no fucking way in hell. There's no way this is gonna work. Jake, you're very handsome, but I don't know if your handsomeness matters that much. This is so pixelated and disgusting that I've just had enough. <gasps> I fixed it! Oh. Oh, I didn't fix it. I did. Ah, I fucking. <laughs> oh. I fixed the pixelization, but like, what is happening to his coat? It is so confusing. He looks like a checkerboard. Oh god, look at him. Oh, he's so ugly. What is happening? Oh wow. Why do those flowers look better than the ones in Animal Crossing? Don't hate. Um I could honestly go with this. Like him he's just a Okay, wait a second. He's just a he's a Doberman. You know, he's a different breed. I mean, ignore the red eyes and the green mouth. I could go, like, this This isn't too bad. 
it's actually fun and exciting and new, actually, if you think about it. So, yeah. Maybe I'm gonna switch to... No, see, what the fuck? If I don't move... Okay, I think I'm on software. I'm on hardware. I'm on software. I'm on hardware. I'm on software. I'm on hardware. That's so odd. Well, what do you guys prefer? Because I'll tell you what I prefer, and it's fucking hardware, even if he looks weird. Because look how fucking gross it is. It, like, honestly, like, when- look at the fucking grass. That was the shit that I hated with Barbie and fucking Ratchet. Like, it is so- it, like, it's like everything's flashing at you. It hurts to look at, so there is no way in hell that I'm gonna sacrifice our fucking eyes because he looks fucking weird. Apparently the only way that you can solve it though is by software. It's very weird. It's very fucking weird. Alright, so basically we're just gonna eat shit and we're gonna just deal with it. We just have to deal with it, boys. Let him be a magical dog that changes in alien ways. Gotcha. I'll do it. One sec. Let me change it back. Let me change it back. Let me change it back. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> hmm. We're just gonna have a dog that looks different. There's nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with a little bit of fucking uniqueness in our lives, okay? Good, I'm glad we understand each other. Didn't I turn this off? That looks so much better. All right, we're gonna go through this and then I'm gonna skip this stuff because we already saw it before. Since I've seen Dog Slave, I'm glad that someone else knows about oh. this game my head what the no daisy oh, must rescue daisy but how hey jake how's it hanging come on i'll race you to the top of the hill oh brother people are so insensitive but i need to get back in shape if i'm gonna look for daisy hold on to your pants here i come Good night. Thank you so much for coming, coming around to my stream and for your help and for putting up with my fucking fatal frame bullshit. I appreciate you. Have a good night. Get your sleep. Get your shit done tomorrow. Do everything you're supposed to do, and do it all. Do it all. Good dog. Well, Jake, looks like I beat you fair and square. Hey, that's Mr. Jake to you, Stinkfoot. So, you want to play another game? Are you kidding? Does a dog poo in the woods? Okay, here goes. Ready, Jake? Less talk, more action. Follow me, Jake! Good dog! Come on, Jake! 
Good boy, Jake. Real good, Jake. Hey, Jake. He's wearing what's up jeans. With you? you okay? You look a little funny. The newspapers <laughs> mentioned a place name. What was it again? I've got to go see Gramps. Mum says he's as crazy as a nudist at the South Pole, but I think he's cool. Why don't you run down to the farmhouse and play with Lopez, the Chihuahua? <laughs> Maybe you can practice your racing technique with her. I'm off to Gramps now. Right? Like, I fucking can't. <laughs> oh, yummy. Oh, that's blurry as fuck. I thought I fixed that. I'm mad. I'm mad. I thought I fixed that. Look at that. That's butt ass ugly. Oh my god. One second. Hold my vodka. One sec. Blurred objects, um, offset effects. That has to be it. I thought I did it already. Wait, okay. All right, I think that fixed over here. But it's still got a problem with that. What the fuck? Bitch, what do I do? Bitch, figure it out. Did that fix it? Did that make it better or worse? Pepe hands. <clears throat> I can't oh. tell. I can't tell. <clears throat> I think this may have made it a little bit better. I can't really tell. I don't, like I did what they told me to do and it's still kind of like, it's not an issue over here anymore, but it's still kind of an issue here. But it's not as harsh, I don't think. <sighs> the blur effect, I mean, isn't as harsh. That's not how cars work, but. It's fine. Excuse me? said set script draw the two one and then someone else said barely any slowdowns works fine the only exception being skip draw which just freezes Ooh. the game screen so it's like bruh all these motherfuckers have <laughs> different settings thank you for the host yeah, but I probably won't be streaming for much longer this was supposed to be a game that I play for an hour and just relax Ooh. but that's my own mistake for thinking that I um, might be able to play it as is. <laughs> There's probably, let me try something else.
I don't think that did anything. thing about this shit is at least it's real time so Alright, I'm gonna just play it on the settings. And I'm gonna just. What is this up here? Where did that come from? Where did that bitch come from? Where'd she come from? Oh. I can fuck up my sleeping schedule hard. Enough to watch streamers in the night for me. That's cute. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's a nice reason, to be honest. Wait, what are the... Bark, sit down and lie down. Sit up and stand. Shake body, okay, far to poo, pee, laugh, pee, right, okay. I don't know how I save. Uh, all right. I think I have to go in a doghouse to save, actually. I don't remember. The music just cut out randomly. What the fuck is happening? <gasps> Scenic! <clears throat> Must play with ball. Jake shoots, he scores. Two more to go. Two more? Bite oh. me. That was almost in. I hate the voice for the dog. I wish they had picked somebody who wasn't 80 years old. Jakey boy rules. One more to go. <laughs> Bite me. Oh, you. Oops. What do you mean about saving? Oh, like the dog houses? What the fuck? That look like that went in. <clears throat> oh yes, sniff my butt. This dog is bad. Is there another one? Like I know I just did that, but is there is there if I get it like three three more times or two more times? 
Fuck you. Oh. Fuck you. No, I don't want that. I want the ball, Jake. There you go. The ball. Alright, he didn't say anything more. Sniff my butt, this dog is bad. Yeah, something like that, I think. Actually. Oh yeah, I need to do this. Fifty purples gets me a bone, and the more bones, the better. Oh my god, the fucking controls in this, I don't remember them being this awful. I don't remember them being this awful. I do not. idea. I'm quite scared as well. <clears throat> it looks like he has like some ornament on his head. Like a fucking religious like big fucking head something. Head pendant or some shit. Those sounds, I know. I know, they're scary. Stuck. Jump. You stupid bitch. What the fuck? You distinct. <laughs> Why'd you type it like that? Oh my god, that's funny. What the fuck? <laughs> Why did you type it like that? That's hilarious. Get me the fuck out of here. Oh my god. You this So fucking funny. Okay. God, this. Oh, God. I do not remember, like, this game not working as well as it I don't know flavorsome flavorsome let's get some stinks get some stinkies eight yellows to play the p marking game i really enjoy this game as like 13 year old kid I don't know what was really oh, wrong with yeah. me. Nice and stinky, does it? I think it's just because it had it. You, it was about dogs. Gosh, armpits. Oh my God, he's cut! What is happening? He 
It looks like he belongs in submerged now. Simply the best. <laughs> I actually kind of like it. It's very um. We never know what we're gonna get. What an aroma! We never know what we're gonna get. It keeps the game fresh. Mm. Uh, poopy. Jesus. Jesus. Cool. Now get all eight, and I can race the local champ. I feel the need, the need to or feed. Speed. Oh. All right, let's beat the bricks off this chihuahua. Go. It's not even fair. We're playing against a fucking chihuahua. Oh, he's gonna get one. Up. Oh, there we go. Yeah, they are gross. Lopez is lucky. The ground is a lot more interesting up close. Look at his fucking is always a pleasure to hear from that. He looks like a fucking frog. So yeah, when you like you'll do you'll do like races, you'll do tons of, tons of different challenges against other dogs and it basically gives you the option to control them. So now I can go in here and get this bone that I wouldn't normally be able to get because Jake is too big. Other dogs doing my dirty work. So I thought that that was really cool. You get to play a bunch of different dogs. Like it's just such a wholehearted, like pure experience, but also the story is awful. Um, like the story is literally like it is anti-dog. So <laughs> it's very Bone suspicious. Delicious. It's definitely not a wholesome experience at all. Well, now, that was Wait, what is this? What is this? What is it? Oh god, the controls are inverted. What is this? I don't know. And yeah, you need a certain amount of uh, bones to take control of certain dogs. Oh, oh, good job there, friends and neighbors. This is Hiram J. Chicken Plucker, but you can call me Hank, right here on CHIK Radio, the voice of Clarksville, chicken capital of the southern part of the What's northeast his name? region. Oh, that's my food. Okay, Yum. it looks like we're all set to hunker down to the next exciting installment of Citizens Question Time, the show where you, the citizens of Clarksville, get to ask your actual questions to me, Hank Chicken Plucker, Clarksville's number one radio celebrity and part-time dentist. Frog's life. By Miss Peach's crunchy cat food, the nicest <laughs> cat food money can buy. Okay, so we got the line open here. Who have you got there, Clarice? Why, it's our local musical celebrity, Hank. Young Kurt Chicken Brain. You know, from down by the bridge over the pond. Oh, sure. How you doing there, Kurt? Far out, dude. It's like a real pleasure to be speaking with Clarksville's other major media personality. Oh, yeah, well, uh, don't get too big for your britches there, young fella. <laughs> I mean, I've been working at CHIK here for longer than I care to recall, whereas you've never, to my uh, knowledge, uh, even once played in public. Yeah, well, the thing is, I mean, I don't want to, like, you know, push myself, dude. I mean, these things have to, like, flow, you know, organically. I mean, you know, I mean, I'm an artist, man. I mean, not, 
not a manufactured media personality who, who runs a third-rate talk show from a room over his dentist's office. Well, you know there, Kurt, a little hard work never hurt anybody. <laughs> and besides, that filling you put in last week is like falling out, man. Uh, Kurt, did you have a question today? Oh, oh yeah, thanks, Clarice. I do got a question. It's just that Hank really bums me out with denying my status as an icon to the, like, you know, like the youth of Clarksville. I mean, when I'm famous and all, don't, don't count on any in-depth interview opportunities and stuff <laughs> like that, is all I can say. Uh, Kurt, did you have a question today? Oh, yeah. Uh, sure, man. Uh, uh, and I wrote it down, too. Uh, let's see. It's right, uh, wh where'd it go? It was, it was just here. But, but then I made well, I made myself some dandelion tea. I put the question down somewhere. Uh, Kurt, are you still with us? Oh shoot! I must have left it in the bathroom. Uh, oh, that's okay there, dude. Kurt. Uh, we got a good little station ID, anyways. You just uh, you just calm down there and uh, uh, maybe visit the bathroom, okay? <laughs> and we'll get back to you. Oh shoot! Uh, you go ahead with the Miss Peaches advert there, Hank, and I'll talk to Kurt. Yeah, okay, sure. Uh, way to go there, Clarice. Uh, so, folks, uh, this is uh, C H I K, the voice of Clarksville, and now <laughs> a word from our sponsor. Hey y'all, Miss this Peaches bitch. talking at ya. I still love you. Yes, I do. Today, I'm back with more inside information on Miss Peach's crunchy cat food, the itty bitty kitty treat that pussy wussies love to crunch. Did you know that each bite of Miss Peach's crunchy cat food is just bursting with sincere <laughs> love? That's because every one of the super nice guys and gals here in my hygienic and germ-free Boom City factory truly and sincerely loves Miss Peach's crunchy cat food. Yes, they do. And they love you, too. Miss Peach's crunchy cat food from Miss Peach's with love. Hey, I'm back. This is Hiram J. Chicken Plucker, but you can call me Hank. And we're smack dab in the middle of Citizen's Question Time. We got Clarksville aspiring singer, songwriter, and high school dropout, Kurt Chickenbrain, on the line. But first, let's check in with our lovely and lively CHIK receptionist, Clarice Chickenfoot, to see if Kurt ever found his written down question in the bathroom. <laughs> uh, Clarice? Well, Hank, in a word. Uh-uh. I'm beginning to wonder if Kurt locked himself in again. You remember the last time we had to call Pete Chickenpacker down the volunteer fire department and it took... Hey, dudes, I'm back. And I found the question. It fell into the toilet. But I, I can still make it out, so no, like, funny remarks, man. No, that's okay there, Kurt. Could happen to anybody. So, what's your question? Oh, yeah. Just, uh... Did, did, it, did either of you dudes check out this, like, you know, humongously shiny big red truck that was passing through town? I mean, it, it had these, like, two, like, the really weird dudes in it. And one was, like, sneezing and, and, and putting down these, like, really negative vibrations. And the other one was like, uh... Whoa, one question at a time there, son. Did we see a shiny red truck? Why, I saw that truck, Hank. It was going round and round the town center like it was lost or something. The two fellas inside were yelling something about that ski resort up to Lake Minnewawa. Oh, wow, that's the truck. Uh, real mysterious, but, but kind of symbolic, too. Uh, I wrote a song about it. It's called The Red Truck Blue. Go something like, <coughs> Whoa, mama, oh, I God. got them shiny old red truck bungalows. Oh, no. I said, Whoa, mama, no. got them blues down in my brown shoe. No. Oh, yeah. Please tell me how to lose them shiny old red truck balloons. That's, uh, well, very, um, thought-provoking there, Kurt. 
Yeah, uh, sure, sure was there, Kurt. Uh, and, and I'm sure it'll sell a zillion copies. But uh, right now, I, I got to play another one of them uh, Miss Peaches commercials. <laughs> so I if you don't mind... Uh... Hey, man, if you don't dig it, then just say so, dude. I mean, you are, like, so two-faced. And you're a lousy dentist, too. <laughs> yeah, well, that's, uh, that's what Citizen Question Time is all about, you know? Healthy debate and open public discussion. After all, this here is a democratic, free-speaking town. <laughs> Clarice? Yes, Hank? Make sure he never calls again. I'll put him on the list. Hey, y'all. Miss Peach is talking at you. I still love you. Yes, I do. Today, I'm back with more inside information on Miss Peach's crunchy cat food, the itty-bitty kitty treat that pussy wussies love to crunch. Did you know that ever last one of the super nice guys and gals here in my Boom City factory undergoes a regular physical examination? Yes, they do, including a thorough skin inspection to root out any possibility of nasty dog fleas that might corrupt the purity of my award-winning crunchy cat food. That's how come every last bite of Miss Peach's crunchy cat food is just bursting with hygienic love. Miss Peach's crunchy cat food from Miss Peach's with love. Howdy doody there, friends and neighbors. This is Hiram J. Chicken Plucker, but you can call me Hank. Right here on CHIK Radio, the voice of Clarksville, the town where everybody knows your business, whether you like it or not. Okay, so we're good to go with the next informative installment of Citizens Question Time, the show where you get to air your actual questions to me, Hank Chicken Plucker, Clarksville's combination, Mr. Fix-It and Mr. Know-It-All. We're sponsored by Miss Peach's crunchy cat food. More crunch for your kitty cat's lunch. <laughs> okay, so I think we got the line open. Who have you got for me today, Clarice? Why, I've got old Gramps Chicken Fart, Hank. You know, from down the road past the bridge over the pond? Oh, sure. How you doing there, Gramps? Eh, not doing so bad, son. Lumbago's playing up a bit. And my nether parts are kind of sore. But yeah, I'm on that there uh, high-protein diet, which means them gas attacks ain't nearly so fierce. Yeah, okay there. Okay there, Gramps. Uh, thanks uh, <clears throat> for sharing. Of course, them bits of gas that does get through, why, they make an almighty great stink. Oh, yes, sir. Why, when the mailman popped by last Tuesday, he come in the yard just as I let rip and danged if he didn't turn a funny shade of green and pass out right there in his tracks. <laughs> yeah, well, that's fine, Gramps, but... Uh... Mind you. You, the quality of my poo is much improved. Why, only this morning. Uh, Gramps, did you have a question for Hank today? Oh, yes. Thanks, Clarice. But, uh, hmm. I, I do have a question, but it, it, not the one I called up about. It, it's a question that popped into my head r right this minute. Well, okay, go ahead there, Gramps. Shoot. <laughs> this is what Citizens Question Time is all about. The spontaneous voice of the people speaking off the top of their minds. Well, heck, Hank, it ain't a question for you. It's more like a question for, uh, Clarice. Clarice? Yep. Well, uh, that's okay, Hank. You go ahead there, Gramps. I'm listening. Hey there now, Clarice, just a gall darn minute. You're only the receptionist at CHIK. I'm the star of this here show. You ask me that question, old timer. Well, I'd love to, Hank. I really would, but, uh... Oh, Clarice, you know how I feel about you. Well, I'm not sure I follow you there, Gramps. It gets lonely down here on the farm. So I was wondering, Clarice, if you'd like to uh, pop around sometime. We could watch Kylie on the video machine. Oh, that there Kylie is a mighty fine dancer. And when she shakes her cute little... Now, hey there, folks. This is CHIK in Clarksville. And now a word from our sponsor. Hey, y'all. Miss Peach is talking at you. I still love you. Yes, I do. Today, I'm back with more inside information on Miss Peach's crunchy cat food, the itty-bitty kitty treat that pussy wussies love to crunch.
Did you know that each bite of Miss Peach's crunchy cat food is just bursting with sincere love? That's because every one of the super nice guys and gals here in my hygienic and germ-free Boom City factory truly and sincerely loves Miss Peach's crunchy cat food. Yes, they do. And they love you, too. Miss Peach's crunchy cat food from Miss Peach's with love. Okay, so this is Hiram J. Chicken Plucker, but you can call me Hank, and we're smack dab in the middle of Citizen's Question Time. We got old Gramps' chicken fart on the line, and we've straightened out a few ground rules here, so we're back to business as usual. Isn't that right, Gramps? Yeah, I suppose, if you say so, Hank. Oh, I do, Gramps. You know that I do. But before you go ahead with your question, here's our lively CHIK receptionist, Clarice Chickenfoot, with the latest local news. Well, thank you, Hank. Well, the news today is that everything seems to be happening in the normal way. The weather today is normal for this time of year. And as normal, I'd like to say hello to my boyfriend, Big Bud Chicken Butt. Hey there, Big Bud. Love you, hun. Yeah, okay, let me ask my darn question. I got a bowel movement to attend to, and it don't feel normal. Uh, Gramps, can I just get back Hey, to there's no need to get snippy there, Gramps, just because I won't come visit. Yeah, well, here's my question. Has anybody seen my dear dog, Daisy? She ain't come back for supper today, and I'm as worried as a butt-naked man in a pasture full of extra-tall poison ivy. Jeepers, <laughs> you should mention your dog, Gramps. In fact, that seems downright spooky, is what it seems. What with them other callers calling about their missing dogs and such like, ain't that right, Hank? Well, I'm sure there's a perfectly normal... See, I need someone to talk to out here on the farm. Daisy's so smart and cute and such good company, and them Kylie videos is getting kind of worn out. I sure could use a bit of female attention, Clarice. Oh, now, Gramps, you don't want me to have to call Big Bud. Big Bud is the jealous type, I promise you. And he can get mean when he's riled. Yeah, okay, you two. Let's get back to the... I understand, Clarice. No hard feelings. It's just that right now I got bad bowels and a broken heart. Hmm. Say, that might just make a good title for a song. Maybe I'll get out my old guitar. See if I can write me a hit. Hey, that's the spirit there, Gramps. You go for it. I got bad bowels and a broken Hank? Yeah. You okay? You look a little tired. No, I'm okay, Clarice. It's it's just that sometimes I think this job is a little too stressful for my personality type. Mm. You mind pressing that button over there? Sure thing, Hank. Hey, y'all. Miss Peach is talking at you. I still love you. Yes, I do. Today, I'm back with more inside information on Miss Peach's crunchy cat food, the itty-bitty kitty treat that pussy wussies love to crunch. Did you know that ever last one of the super nice guys and gals here in my Boom City factory undergoes a regular physical examination? Yes, they do, including a thorough skin inspection to root out any possibility of nasty dog fleas that might I know that she keeps repeating this, but I'm listening for the other sec. That's how come every last bite of Miss Peach's crunchy cat food is just bursting with hygienic love. Miss Peach's crunchy cat food from Miss Peach's with love. Heidi ho and Heidi hey there, friends and neighbors. This is Hiram J. Chicken Plucker. You can call me Hank. Right here on CHIK Radio, broadcasting to you direct from downtown Clarksville. Okay. It looks like we're all set for Citizens Question Time here on CHIK. Let's the hope show this is where different. you, the actual <laughs> citizen, get to ask your actual question to me. We're sponsored by Miss Peach's Crunchy Cat Food, and we got a number of her award-winning messages coming up later in the show okay so we got the line open here who have you got there clarice why it's merle chicken wing the chicken farmer oh how you doing there merle doing okay there hank how's about
by you. Oh, not so good, Merle, you know. Got a touch of the wobbly tummy today. <laughs> Think I must have ate a funny hot dog at the state fair. Oh, sorry to hear that, Hank. And, uh, speaking of dogs... Go ahead, Merle. Oh, thank you, Clarice. Uh, my question is this. What the heck is happening to the dogs of Clarksville? Whoa, that's one heck of a question there, Merle. <laughs> but I don't get it. Uh, did a big old dog come and poop in your chicken coop? No, it's just that there seemed to be less dogs around than there was last week. And I was just wondering if... Uh... Oh, gotta do a little station ID here, Merle. Okay, okay. So, folks, this is CHIK, the voice of Clarksville. This here is Hiram J. Chicken Plucker, but you can call me Hank. And we're smack dab in the middle of Citizen's Question Time. But first, a word from our sponsor. Hey, y'all. Miss Peach is talking at ya. I still love you. Yes, I do. Today, I'm back with more inside information on Miss Peach's, Peach's crunchy cat food. E B kitty pizza with easy love to crunch. You know that each bite of Miss Peach's crunchy cat food is I want this bitch to shut up so I can listen to the radio. Because every one of the yeah, fucking cunt. Black and mild. Welcome back to the big dick owl. Big dick club. Pew, 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 pew. Are they Canadian? No, this takes place in the UK as far as I know. Thank you, Miss Peaches. Always a pleasure. Let's get to the real news. Oh, yeah, we do. <laughs> but more on that later. We got Clarksville chicken farmer Merle Chicken Wing on the line. He's holding on there. But first, our charming receptionist, Clarice. What do you think of what the heck may or may not be happening vis-a-vis -vis the local dog situation, Clarice? Uh, can I just stick my paddle in the creek here, Hank? Sorry, Clarice. No, that's okay, Merle. You go for it. I'm just painting my nails here anyway. Okay. It was about the dogs. There's less of them than before. Like, they seem to be running off or some darn thing. My Sadie, for instance, well, she just up and disappeared last Tuesday. Jeb Chickenfinger down the road. Jeb Chickenfinger? He run off too? Oh, no. Uh, that little wiener dog of Jeb's. He just up and disappeared last Tuesday, too. Gone like the wind. Well, speaking of wind, my next-door neighbor's dog, you know old Mrs. Chickenstring, she's the one with the wind problem, not her dog, but her dog seems to have up and gone, too. Uh, say there, Clarissa, uh, Merle, can I just stick my nose in here? Uh, now, now here's the thing, Merle. Uh, I gotta play another one of them nice Miss Peaches commercials. After all, they do sponsor the show now, don't they? <laughs> so it's only polite. But I'll get back to you right quick. Well, actually, Hank, my chicks need feeding. So if it's all the same to you... Oh, heck no. You go ahead there, Merle. Just give us a tinkle when you can spare a mow, and we'll get down to the bottom of this here uh, disappearing dog business. <laughs> Uh, you take care there, Merle. Okay, now let's hear that word from our sponsor. Hey, y'all. Miss Peach is talking at you. I still love you. Yes, I do. Today, I'm back with more inside information. Let's get right into the news. <laughs> the itty bitty kitty treat that and into the news. Uh, Did you know? That ever last one of the super nice guys and gals here in my Boom City factory undergoes a regular physical examination? Yes, they do. Including a third I hate this bitch. I'm not here for you, stinky pants. I'm here for the radio, fucking bitch. God damn. I don't want to hear your fucking. You miss me, Tim? Miss me? No. It's 12 a.m. I should be off. I'm trying. Let me just climb this real quick. Just get up there and. Uh, really necessary. Just get. Uh, get. Fuck. Oh, I. Sorry. Sorry about that. Oh, yeah. I should have been doing this. I should be in first person. Duh. What else? What else is there? 
Oh. Sorry. I made him... He's not feeling too good because I made him fall like 50 feet. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. I'd say no. <clears throat> but, you know, there's dog's life to play. I want to play for a little bit longer because the past like 30 minutes we were just listening to the radio thing. Yeah. Because I love that. That shit. I was eating donuts. I was having the time of my fucking life. Let's see if well it's now, different. That was our own Loretta chicken meat from right here in Fuck. Did I miss well it? Oh, okay. Fuck that bitch. When... Hey there, Hank. Hold your horses. I think you forgot to press the button that turns on the transmitter. Oh, no. Again? Oh, shucks. Yep, so we have to start the show all over. Oh, well, shoot, Clarice. Uh, that was one of the best shows we've ever done with, with the missing dog information and all. Award-winning stuff. Oh, well, never mind. We showbiz types are used to these ups and downs. Okay. Here goes... Goo goo ga -joob there, friends and neighbors. This is Hiram J. Chicken Plucker, but you can call me Hank, right here on CHIK Radio, the voice of Clarksville, chicken capital of the southern part of the northeast region. Okay, it looks like we're all set to hunker down to the next exciting installment of Citizens Question Time, the show where you, the citizens of Clarksville, get to ask your actual questions to me, Hank Chicken Plucker, Clarksville's number one radio celebrity and part-time dentist. We're sponsored by Miss Peach's Crunchy Cat Food, the nicest cat food money can buy. Okay, so we got the line open here. Who have you got there, Clarice? Why, it's our local musical celebrity, Hank. Young Kurt Chickenbrain. You know, from down by the bridge over the pond? Oh, sure. How you doing there, Kurt? Far out, dude. It's like a real pleasure to be speaking with Clarksville's other major media personality. Oh, yeah, well, uh, don't get too big for your britches there, young fella. <laughs> I mean, I've been working at CHIK here for longer than I care to recall, whereas you've never, to my uh, knowledge, uh, even once played in public. Yeah, well, the thing is, I mean, I don't want to, like, you know, push myself, dude. I mean, these things have to, like, flow, you know, organically. I mean, you know, I mean, I'm an artist, man. I mean, not, not a manufactured media personality who, who runs a third-rate talk show from a room over his dentist's office. Well, you know there, Kurt, a little hard work never hurt anybody. <laughs> and besides, that filly you put in last week is like falling out, man. Uh, Kurt, did you have a question today? Oh, oh yeah, thanks, Clarice. I do got a question. It's just that Hank really bums me out with denying my status as an icon to the, like, you know, like the youth of Clarksville. I mean... When I'm famous and all, don't, don't count on any in-depth interview opportunities and stuff like that, is all I can say. Uh, Kurt, did you have a question today? Oh, yeah. Uh, sure, man. Uh, uh, and I wrote it down, too. Uh, let's see. It's right, uh, wh where'd it go? It was, it was just here. But, but then I made, well, I made myself some dandelion tea. And, huh, I put the question down somewhere. Uh, Kurt, are you still with us? Aw, oh, shoot. I must have left it in the bathroom. Uh... Oh, that's okay there, Kurt. Uh, we gotta do a little... What's up, Insane? Thanks for the lurk. You just, uh, you just calm down. Hope that you're doing well. Uh, uh, maybe visit the bathroom, okay? <laughs> and we'll get back to you. Aw, oh, shoot! Uh, you go ahead with the Miss Peaches advert there, Hank, and I'll talk to Kurt. Yeah, okay, sure. Uh, way to go there, Clarice. Uh, so, folks, uh, this is uh, CHIK, the voice of Clarksville. And now, <laughs> a word from our sponsor. Hey, y'all. Miss no. Peach is talking no. at you. I still love you. No. Yes, I do. No. Today, I'm back with Get you. away. God, I hate her. She's the worst. Did it just loop? I don't. Excuse me, I don't think so. 
Maybe. Three more reds for a game of doggy do. If I find them, the local dog shows me some tricks. Excuse me. Yes, thank you. <laughs> I hate it. Not yet. Now you go. <clears throat> Hello? Your move, my man. Uh oh. I like. What? I don't know how I did that because I. What the fuck? Go for it, guy. I think it's lost. Are you playing? I think it's bug. He said left, right, left, down, left, right, up. Left, it, right, guy. left. Down. Left, right, up. Jesus. <clears throat> so I got beg one. Thank you. Bye. God, look at his fucking feet. I had a chihuahua, I miss him. Nothing, he he didn't die yet, but um... He stopped living with me. But it's sad, cause he's like... He's got huge fucking cataracts over his eyes, so he can't see anymore, and it's really fucking sad. I don't know what those things are used for yet. Also, Black and Mild, how are you? How are you doing? I just want everyone to know that you can pick up your poop in your mouth, and then when you bark, it makes this noise. You can throw your pe like poop at people. It's just disgusting. Super. It's awesome. It's disgusting, but it's awesome. You know. I'm better now that I'm in time for the poop features in this game. <laughs> They're gnarly. I know. Whoa! That went straight through me. He's a horsey. Oh my god, the size of the dog in comparison to the horse? I mean, that's pretty real. It's pretty realistic, to be honest. So we could go see Jake at Gramps. Gramps is the one that, um, he lives not far from the farm, but Daisy is Gramps' dog. Um, and Daisy was the girl at the beginning that Jake has a crush on. And I she... Underpants. And she got, um, abducted. <clears throat> they, like, put her in a van and we don't know where she went. Oh, I feel like this is definitely... I don't know what this is, but it's definitely a collectible. Don't throw it like that, Jake. Pick it up. You freaking just put Far it down. Far out, dog, dude. But I need three more to power up my amp. Oh. Then it's Bone City for you. Bone. He said the magic word. This game is basically a do documentary. Real life. Oh my god. Yeah, it's exactly like real life. Except like nothing like real life. So yeah. 
Hey, cut it out. Wait, I have to load. Can you give him poop? I could. I could pick up my poop and I can give it to him. But he won't be happy. He will not be happy about that decision. <clears throat> Whoa, don't step in that. Wait, I'm going to go over here and talk to him. Oh man, what a bummer. My amplifier batteries are dead. Like, what am I supposed to do? Hey, dog dude, <coughs> bring me a battery and I like toss you a bone. You dig? <coughs> I can dig for bones, but this sounds much easier. Yeah, so Jake gets dirty. Like, it's like, you know how in Barbie, um, the horse gets dirty? Jake gets dirty. You can't tell because the game is bugging out, but... He gets dirty and you can go in water or like this bath thing to clean him up. Hey, cut it out. Oh my god, did you see it bounce? Why is it swimming? I'm so scared. Um <laughs> Yeah, it was like acting like a fish. That was weird. Um, but yeah, what was I saying? Fuck, I forget. Um, yeah, you can wash him. So like there's certain cities, like districts of people in this game. And like if you go to a neighborhood that's like really, really posh with like these snobby fucking rich people, then they won't like like you or talk to you or help you or give you missions if you're dirty. And they'll like be like, you fucking dirty ass dog, you're gross, you're fucking nasty, take a bath, you feline. Oh no. Let's mark the corners to gain fields and show that dog that I rule. This shit used to piss me off on Three, these fucking on the harder two, dogs. It shouldn't be one, this go. big of a problem. Are you serious right now? What the fuck? Do you see why this shit is infuriating? Mine, bitch. You snooze, you fucking lose, dork. Is this a P race? It is indeed a P race. Fuck you. <laughs> it's just infuriating. Because it's like, I'm working on this square. Like, you could definitely just go and fucking get the other squares. But, like, on the dogs that are, like, in other districts, they get really fucking hard. And it's, like, obnoxious. This game is wild as fuck. I used to play this shit all the time when I was, like, 12. <clears throat>
far out, dog dude. But I need three more to power up my amp. Then it's Bone City for you. Did you see that message oh, in a bottle? He said that magic word. What the fuck? Was that? <clears throat> hmm. <clears throat> wow, you are one clever little dude, dude. Just, uh, let's see, uh, two more to get that bone. <sighs> Must have bones. <laughs> What's up, Rick? What it do? Suck a shoe. Pinky poo. I don't know. I'm sorry. I ran out of things to say. <laughs> I apologize. Get up there. Jump. I don't think I want to fuck with the bees. <laughs> Bye. Are they chasing me? Oh my god, they're chasing me. Oh my god, run. Jake, run. Okay, we're cool. What's up, Giuseppe? How are you? What is this? I think I'll sit this one. Out. You can jump in. The Hello, you can jump in the water, Jake. It's okay. There you go. What are these? Okay, they're nothing. My night's going okay. Thanks for asking. Um. I spent like three hours doing nothing in Fatal Frame earlier. That was not my best or proudest moment. Um. I'm just gonna replace whatever that guitarist says with dude. Heck yeah. I can co-sign that. <clears throat> no, whatever the fuck your do your name is, I'm not here for you right now. I'm trying to get this guy his shit so I can get my bone. Out of sight. When I get that last battery, I'm really going to wail. Sometimes I ask myself, is it worth it? <laughs> I really, for the most part, I love the humor in this game. I really do. I know where the other one is, but I'm not sure if I can get it right now. Oh, there I got it. Never mind. Oh, there's a freaking mousey. Grab him. So I think you can fucking, you can just keep these and then I think you can kill them. I'm afraid that you can kill them. Get him, get him. Oh wait, that's not it. Sorry. Wait, how do I how do I shake again? I forget how you kill them. Probably by throwing them or some shit. I don't know. I hope you can't kill them, but I feel like you could. Here you go, little guy. Just just, just fall down. There you go. I want, like, dude. You know what? I should jump up here. Um, 
before I leave this area. Hey, I'm back. No, this is I don't want to talk to you. Just stop. And we'll smack dab and <laughs> hey y'all, Miss Peach is talking at you. I still love you. Yes, I do. Today, I'm back with more Thank you for the biddies. information on Miss Peach. Hey, it's cats that have nine lives. <laughs> You're right, Jake. My bad. You are absolutely right, partner. My bad. I think there's pizza over here. All right. Dog, dude, you are the man. Here you go. I think this is the main menu or main theme. I don't know. Hit that shit. He is shredding it. All right, goodbye, my friend. Also, it looks like <laughs> Jake has, like, shoes on. <laughs> like, shoes on because they were, like, blue and yellow. Whatever. Um, maybe in the water. Wait, what's Nocturne? Um, I should just look it up. Time splitters. I feel like I've heard of that. I definitely have. I 
Yeah, I don't want to go to the water mill yet. So let's... Oh, no. I hated it there. I think I hated most of the levels in this game, to be honest. <laughs> Which doesn't make sense. Because I say that this is, like, one of the favorite... One of my favorite games that I played when I was a kid. Oh, but also... Yes. I say Dra Dragon Age Origins... Shut up. Dragon Age Origins is, like, one of my favorite games ever. And probably my favorite Dragon Age game. But, like, literally, if I think back to it, there isn't, like, a this single, way. like quest or like like main fucking level quest in that game that I don't like hate with all of my being so hey Jake yeah. I've been expecting you Gramps is drooling in his sleep again can you bark him awake can I bark him awake that's so rude why would I do that also remember that uh, spider I was talking about earlier that was like hanging above my um what's it called my door frame now he's hanging above like my other wall like now he's closer to me and that bitch is so big like who gave her the right first of all why are you why are your legs that long why is your body that big why is it like why are you crawling along the fucking roof, the fucking ceiling in my room? I'm feeling very threatened. I'm feeling very uneasy. Like, where are you going? Are you trying to go over there? Because that's above my bed and I'm concerned for my safety. Like, I really don't care if this spider chills in my room. You want to chill in my room? Go ahead. Live and let live. But. Just don't bite me, dog. Just don't bite me and don't crawl on me. That's it. That's my only two prerequisites. Like, my only two requirements. If you're going to live in, if you're going to live long alongside me. You want to you wanna chill up there? I don't care if I can see you. Okay? I acknowledge your existence. I see you for mutuals. But as soon as you cross the fucking ground and you bite me, and you have the, you are not even that big of a man or a woman to bite me when I'm like awake, but you bite me when I'm asleep, you coward. You coward. After I give you the fucking right to live here. You don't pay rent, you don't pay taxes, you don't supply me with food. You do nothing for me. But I, out of the kindness of my heart and the fact I'm a Pisces, I allow you to live here. And then you bite me while I sleep. Just, have you ever been so disrespected in your own household that you just cannot even fathom? That's how I feel. So yeah, also I've never seen a spider like that in my room before, which also I feel like is a cause for an alarm. I don't want to like bark at him. Enter the kennel. Is that what that's called? A kennel? A kennel. A kennel. Okay. Okay. What do I know? It's not like I, you know know anything I guess nothing at all hm. oh wow yeah I got all the stinkies I got all the smells in this uh this uh level that's why it gave me a bone I'm sorry I don't want to do this it's not nice it's not polite Jack. Oh, Jake. That <clears throat> Jake you bad bad boy you told me to do that. <laughs> yes, sir, <-y>, Bob. <laughs> Ooh, oh, sorry, Jake. Um, Daisy ain't here. Don't you realize that Daisy's been dog napped? Go back to sleep, Gramps. She'll turn up soon. I hope so. She's my best girl. Mm-mm. Daisy smelled so good. I must find her. 
<laughs> Say, Jakey, let's see what tricks you can do besides waking up a poor old man out of a lovely dream. Stand. Good dog. Sit, Jake. Good dog. Lie down, Jake. Good dog. Nice moves, Jake, but nobody moves like my Daisy. Don't worry, Gramps. She's probably having her daily swim. You're right. Cleanest dog in Clarksville. Smartest, too. Say, Jake, I don't suppose you could track her down. I don't know what I'd do without her. Wahoo! At last! <laughs> Farmhouse? Wait, what does that say? Farm? Or field? Where does this take me? Big field? Huh. Hello? I'm a dog. I don't know if you knew that. Alright, great. Oh my god. This music is so nostalgic for me. Well, it, blues gets oh me no. a bone. And boy, do I need bones. Whoa, that should clean out my sinuses. Whoa, that went straight through me. Fuck. Why are they having me weave back and forth? Armpits. What kind of satanic ass shit? I wonder what that spider is waiting for. What are you waiting for, bud? You think I didn't notice that you were at the other side of the room and now you're above me? Like, you think I can't see or something? Like, you, you think I'm dumb? Like, are you insulting my Adela? Essence of dead rat. Take, you can take your time. Hit me again, my hey, friend. Hey, thanks for the bit, bro. Oh, yes. Smells like a basset hound I once knew. Appreciate it. What an aroma. Gosh, armpits. This music is so nice. I've heard sheep dogs can be pretty stubborn. I didn't know how I had a bit. Well, thanks for giving me. Excuse me, your only bit. That means a lot to me. <clears throat> Spider is just not moving. <clears throat> I hope he's okay. Wahoo! At last! I hope that he is a okay. <clears throat> I'm glad you finally got your fucking shit back, dude. Holy fuck. Holy fucking macaroons. I definitely should save since I haven't saved yet. Besides save states. Say there, boy. Wanna earn a bone? Uh, my Wanna sheep dog refuses bone. to round up the darn sheep. Can you get her to do the job? Holy fuck, it's almost one o'clock in the morning. Okay, I need to go to sleep. I need to go to sleep. 
<clears throat> um. I'm trying to identify what kind of spider is in my room right now. It looks like maybe a hobo spider. Maybe. Siesta time. I don't know what the fuck it is, to be honest. I have no idea. I can't tell. I don't know what it is, but I'm scared. I've never seen anything like it before. Fearful. What a smart looking dog. Yeah, thanks. I'm so smart. Say hello, doggy. Hi. Well, I'm sure I could. Thank you. Mm, Very sweet of you. Baby. All right, so I have to collect some shit. Not some like actual shit, but I have to collect some uh, smelly things, and then I have to like win a challenge against um, that shepherd, whatever dog, the herding dog, and then I'll be able to control it. Oh, yummy! And um, do its job for it, basically. If I uh, remember and understand correctly. Jake loves both. I'm just getting bones and bones and bones. Mm, smells. It's what life's all about. <laughs> bones and bones and bones and bones. Okay. <clears throat> okay, probably the P one. Whoa, don't step in that. Sweet. Definitely the P one. Getting stuck. Got it. Lit. If I find eight of these, I can do the digging challenge. Mmm, stinky smells. It's what life's all about. At last, a peeing game. Mark the corners. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. This dog's breath stinks like, well, like dog breath.
Wahoo! Mission accomplished. I've never seen her work so hard. Almost like she was possessed. There you go, boy. Aw, oh, Dad Bernie. I knew I should have got a gate for this here pen. Bone-tastic. Gosh, armpits. Okay, sadly, I think I'm gonna have to stop streaming. As soon as I finish collecting what I need from this area, I will end the stream and find someone to raid. I stream for a little over eight hours. Um, I don't know if I'll stream more Fatal Frame tomorrow, probably, but, you know, what? a bitch a is just Dig holes. tired, um, Three, but two, yeah. One, go. <clears throat> Fuck. <clears throat> This fucking music, I can't. <clears throat> no, Ken, why'd you raid me? I'm about to end. How is your stream? Oh my god, he's covered in mucus now. What the fuck? <clears throat> Let me see what you were playing. Oh, oh wait, it was a real life stream. Your viewers were blessed. I did say once I finished collecting the shit in this game that I would end stream, but I guess I'll play for a little bit longer. Cooking the good food, I'm glad to hear it. I'm playing this game that I used to play when I was a kid. You basically like these, these dogs are getting like kidnapped, so like dog napped or whatever, and you basically like com compete like against all the other dogs, and then you can like there's like missions, and you have to collect like these smells, and then you compete against these other dogs, and then you can control them, and then like reach parts of the level that you wouldn't be able to reach because of Jake's size. Um, so that's cool. Every time I try to repair the scarecrow, I get attacked by birds. Well, I won't give in. I tell you, private dog, this means war. Better get rid of those birds for him before he has a heart attack or something. <clears throat> ah, curse you, you crapulous crows. Battle stations. I don't know what to do besides bark. Is this on DS? I have no idea. I'm playing it from PS2, but I don't know if it's on DS. They may have won the battle, private dog, but they won't win the war. Well, I can't let those dive bombing birds win, can I? Oh, every time I try to Wait, what do I do? I get attacked by birds. Well, I won't give in. I tell you, private dog, this means war. What the fuck do I do? Maybe, am I supposed to play? Maybe I'm supposed to play as the other dog. Made pasta directly on the stovetop. No pots, no pans, just stove. <laughs> Narakali? Narakali? 
Narakali, thank you for the the follow. Welcome. Let's see if we play as this dog instead. I'm not sure. Probably not. I don't think so. Every time I try to repair the scarecrow, I get attacked by birds. Old suds. Well, I give in. What the I tell you, private fuck dog, does this old means suds war. taste Better like? Get those birds for him before he has a heart attack or something. I don't know what to do to help him. What do I do? What's up, Afghan? How are you? Bones. That's what it's all about. I don't know how I get rid of the birds. The battle, private dog. But they won't win the war. Well, I can't let those dive bombing birds win, can I? Well, they just poop on you, don't they? Like, what's the problem with that? Oh, every time I try to repair the scarecrow, I get attacked by birds. Well, I won't give in. I tell you, private dog, this means war. You, you crapulous crows! Battle stations! You're not getting attacked by them. They're just pooping on you. Why are you being so dramatic? Ah, curse you, you crapulous crows! Battle stations! Oh, I don't yes. know how Life to help him. Good. Also, if you guys are like, what the fuck's wrong with Jake's skin? I don't know. What the fuck? I went to look up like a walkthrough because I wanted to see what to do here and I looked up a dog's life walkthrough and it's like a pace bin. It says look, bite, tie, drop, tie, tilt head, whine, whimper, deliberate, shallow breaths, gallop, roll, what the fuck? Bite, puffing for breath. Chase. Oh my god. Okay, I read something that I I don't want to read out loud. But if you just want to go to that link and then you want to control F and type balls, then you might see what I don't want to read out loud. What I'm just going to click away from that. I'm just... I don't even want to know. No, don't post it in chat. Jesus. Can't take your people back. Take them back. <laughs> take them back. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's fine. Um. It's <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. Okay. It says you just have to keep barking. What the Curse fuck? You, you crapulous crows! Battle stations! I like it a lot. He did it earlier with the F word, I'm dead. Oh my god. <laughs> That's funny. They may have won the battle, private dog, but they won't win the war. Well, I can't let those dive bombing birds win, can I? Oh, every time I try to repair the scarecrow, I oh get my God. attacked by Cut birds. Cutscenes you can't well, skip. 
I tell you, private dog, this means war. Keep it up. Wow. Oops, sorry, I hit the wrong button. <clears throat> wrong Brit. I'm dead. <clears throat> Now I'm racist. Yiker. <laughs> Success. That ends their reign of bird poop. Couldn't have done it without you, Private. You are a first-class bird dog. Oh, brother, this guy is one sad case. Private first-class dog. I hereby award you with the order of the white bone. I don't understand. Like, why is he saying he got attacked by the birds, but like you have all these wow, ribbons dude, and medals, but like last. you're getting attacked by birds. Do you have like PTSD or are you just retarded? Hashtag Ken with two N's zero nine zero is over party. Join in. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> okay. All right, what do I have left? I have two more bones in this area. How? How do I have two bones in this area? Oh, I'm done with Clarksville. I'm done with Clarksville. How do I have two more bones in this area? Where are they? One must be the air. Oh, I bet I have to wait until the air balloon dude comes down or something unless they're both in here oh yes life is good you have to eat the farmer's legs for the remaining two bones oh, my favorite i mean that could be done that could be arranged did i collect all of them Okay, it said I had 15, right? And I had I had these seven, right? And then I just picked up two. So why? Unless, wait, am I stupid? I thought that there'd be another one here. But I don't think there is. I think it's just that, maybe. So I think I can do water mill, um, and then village I can do again. Or a village I can do, I can start. But I should really go to sleep because it's one o'clock in the fucking morning. So it was gonna get off like two hours ago. Be left, be right, you can control. Yeah. Yeah. Dogs don't have much freedom. Let them enjoy the freedom that they have. Excuse me. Just one leg, there's multiple bones in each. Okay, my god. Alright, I'm gonna go back. Please. <clears throat> Honestly, I prefer Jake as a black dog. I need this game. It's on PS2. Chicken farm. Let's do this. What kind of dog can make a jump like that? Like I'm shook. I like it a lot. <clears throat> Eat land, fox thing. Mm, I don't remember bones being like this easy. Oh, mama. This is all that a house has inside of it. PS2. PS2 era. <clears throat> Give me that pizza. Sweet. I don't know who put that pizza underneath the barrel. Oh, yes. 
100% But I appreciate them. Ah, the bees. Are they chasing me? They're ta they're chasing me, aren't they? The fuckers. The evil fuckers. Yeah, fuckers. Eight orange cents for a tug of war match. No. No, I don't remember liking those. Mm, a bone. Yeah, the voice acting is. The sound effects are worse than the voice acting, Whoa, if you can believe that went it. Straight through me. Just wait until he starts oh, farting every three seconds. Ugh. Me as an archaeologist digging up mummy remains. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy. Your fucking humor is the exact same as mine. That's fucking hilarious. Me as an archaeologist. <laughs> Oh my god, that's so fucking funny. That was good. That was oh, genuinely yes. good. Thank stink. you for that. <clears throat> Eight pinks for a pursuit challenge. I love how the game just ruins this. It just spoils the surprise for you. Whoa, like that's don't genius. step in that. Thank you for that. I don't know. I forget what pursuit is. I've got more bones than this guy. Time to have a little fun. Oh. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Jesus! I didn't even see oh, he did that. Good. What I can't the even fuck? See my nose. I don't need to play him right now. I'd just rather go collect the shit. Jake's so toxic comparing bones, right? Like, it doesn't matter. You don't have to, Jesus, Whoa, that jump. Did something die? Yeah, it was me, it was my soul. Whoa, that went straight through me. You didn't have to BM the other dogs like that, right? Like, it just shows he's a coward. True confidence moves in silence. <laughs> uh huh. Uh. <laughs> What's over here? Can I hit my F1 with. Yes. Oh. I was gonna see if I could hit it with my foot because I'm laying back like a lazy bitch and I didn't want to have to sit up because I'm being a lazy bitch. Uh, okay, that's scary. Whoa, it's a skunk! What the fuck was that? Was that a skunk? Did I just get attacked? Look at him. <laughs> Got him. Bye. Thank you. I'll take this. Super. Yeah, try to stink me from across the block. Bye bye, dork. Shocked <laughs> him. Yeah, sadly, there isn't just like a drop. And you have to throw things that are in your mouth. You're making stovetop shrimp. Oh my god. Do I want to know? Not bad. I'm scared. Okay, I know what I have to do with the little dog now. Look at that booty. Oh yes. Life is good. 
The only thing I don't like about this texture bug, besides it being butt-ass ugly, is it's hard to tell when Jake is dirty. So I'll probably just have to, like, randomly, like, send him in the water. Or the rich, snobby fucking people are gonna be like, you're a mutt, I guess, basically. Whoa! What the hell? Chill. Chill out. Fucking tank controls? Give me a break. What am I doing? I know. I need to talk to the farmer. Oh yeah, I probably can't... I probably can't do the quest until I get the quest. Wow. You hear about the dog nappings around here? Oh my god, every Trump well, supporter. There was even an article in the local paper, but I tore it up to use as bedding for my chickens. Can you find it? Wait, I'll read what you said in a sec. Hello? It's literally like tank controls, it's awful, I love it. Like, what a terrible design choice. But you go, girl. Yep. Says here, Clarksville dog napping epidemic spreads to Lake Minnewawa Ski Resort. That's where those creeps took Daisy. I hope this keeps you strong. I reckon you might need it. Wow. I'm surprised you can read. bone delicious. I did not engage, but I would like to go on record and say my feet are delect delectable. Delectable? You're not a chicken chaser, are you, boy? Get rid of that flap doodly fox, and I got something for you. Yup. Hey. Some of my best friends chase chickens. Wait, what did he want me to do again? I wasn't even listening. Scrumptious? Delicious? Can somebody ban him? Get him out. Get him out of here, weirdo. Am I supposed to get rid of the fox? What the hell am I doing? I like literally forgot. Now where's that bedding? Guess it must be in the coops. What the fuck? Am I supposed to get all of the fucking... Okay, wait, wait, wait. Wait. Wait, what am I... Okay, great. I don't know what to do. Um... Okay, get rid of the fox. Okay. I don't remember exactly, but I remember you like teleporting around the city and then finally going around underground at a cemetery. I think it was in here forever ago when you were playing some kind of vampire game. Probably Vampire Bloodlines. Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. That's definitely the game. I think. At the time, so it may have been a fever. <laughs> Your personality is incredible. Down in one. Oh. 
I think he was bugged. I think he was literally bugged because I don't think he was supposed to be stuck on top uh, like that. I've been after that bushy-tailed bandit since my foxhound just up and disappeared. Take this bone, my friend. You earned it. Afghan, thank you for following. Welcome. Like, okay, he I literally has this lot. giant fucking, like, what are they called? 12 gauge? Fucking, I don't know. Fucking gun that shoots two fucking bullets at the same time and both of them are really powerful. Like, I, it's funny because I was actually talking to my, like, my stepfather the other day and I was like, what the fuck do you need a shotgun for? Literally, what do you need a shotgun for? You have your hunting rifles. You have your nine like you have your pistols for like self defense. You have your hunting rifles for hunting, or fucking like an AR, right? But like, what the fuck do you need a shotgun for? Because I was like thinking. Oh, like, if you have a shotgun as, like, home defense, I feel like you wouldn't even need to, like, use it. Because if you just have, like, a... If you have a pump shotgun, I feel when you pump that shit, like, the sound it makes would scare off people who, like, legitimately weren't... Like, if it was just, like, a robbery and people aren't, like, planning to die, then I feel like hey, hearing dog, the pump would scare them the off. But, like, even if you did use... Because I, like, okay, if I have a self-defense weapon, I never want to, like, kill somebody. I just want to defend myself, obviously. But, like, a shotgun is... You can't just, like, shoot somebody with a shotgun and be like, you're going to be fine. You're going to live. Like, you'll be fine. You know what I mean? Like, it's a weapon where you're going to shoot somebody with the intention of killing them because it's a fucking shotgun. Like... And I was talking to him about it, and he was like, yeah, plus, think about how messy it is. Like, if you're defending yourself from intruders that are coming in your home, I really doubt that you're going to want to fucking, like, shoot them with a shotgun. Because putting their life aside, you're also going to get their fucking blood and guts everywhere, as well as maybe destroy part of your house if you're shooting them point blank. Like, I'm... <laughs> I'm just confused for when a bear pulls up stuff. Like, he said, um, maybe, like, for duck hunting, or... I don't know if that's what he said for shotgun. He said something. And I was like, I guess. Um, I guess. Yeah, I don't know why he just, like, was like, yeah, I've been trying to get that fox for, like, ages. And I've been like, what? He literally stood on top of that thing. But, like, okay. So good. Stay in there. Oh, he... I don't think he's in there. Did he go in there? Or when a bear pulls up. Yeah. Because bears are like... I don't know. They're pretty stealthy. You're not going to hear a bear coming. I mean, let's be honest. They're pretty much the size of a thumbtack anyway. I'm trying to throw this. There you go. No, wait a second. Maybe I have to use the smaller dog. <clears throat> Fun fact, when you were streaming earlier, like like 12 hours or something ago, um, I was like, I had your stream turned up like really high. Um... And I was also like fucking listening to Hercules by Young Thug, so I had my music turned up really fucking loud. And then all of a sudden I just hear, what could I grab that would really just have you understand where I was coming from? All of a sec, like all of a sudden I just started hearing this noise that really just ruined my life. Let me find something real quick that will compensate. I don't think I have anything that will compensate. Okay, I basically heard I 
And I was like, is this man for real? Like, your fucking microphone. Your fucking, like, mic was right next to that shit. And he was like, yeah, the, the fucking, sorry, my bad. The fucking, what did you say? The bag's on top of the mic. And I'm like, <laughs> This man, I was, <laughs> and it was like not even. I think plastic bag probably sounds worse, but like you were, it was like crunching, like the crunching of that of like the chip bag type of like material. Oh my god, I was. It was like for I didn't even say anything. It happened for like three minutes, and I'm like, I can't take this any longer, and because I, I figured you'd stop, but you didn't, and I was like, I have to tell him because. Nobody else wants to tell him. So it's okay. Good. Honestly, I'd be fucking going ham. But I just like, I go ham with the candy too, but I fucking mute my mic I, for the most part. But then, but then again, I'll have a tick that's like super loud. So I'm really no different when you think about it. I'm trying to get all these chickens in their coops. I don't think it matters, but I'm gonna I'm try it anyway. Where are they? Are they over here? Where the hell are they? I hear them. Hey, come here. Look at him running fast. He's running fast. God damn it, I can't get them. Gotcha, bitch. All right, put the bitch in the coop. Does he actually? Oh shit! Get up! I think the the chickens have to be in their own coops. Maybe I don't know. No. Oh god, he went through. Oh my god, I shook all his hair off. Did you see that? He was naked. He was naked. Hop in the shower. All right. Ken, I'm so happy for you. I'm very happy for you, by the way. Have a good rest of your night. Get some rest if you're able to. Thank you again for the raid. I hope you have a great night. Yeah, like, you deserve that fucking shit. You deserve to live in your own fucking place. You put up with that dumb assery for so long. I think all of them are in there. What the fuck is YJSMLS? <laughs> what does that mean? But yeah, I'm just happy for you. You deserve better, so... Yes, King. This is gonna be a pain in the ass, this last, um, well, actually, I still have more purple. Oh my god, fuck my life. Mmm, stinky smells. It's what life's all about. 6 a.m. for me here, gotcha. Thank you for chilling. I appreciate the fuck out of you. Thanks for following too. Oh yes. Nice and stinky does it. I hope you have a great night. Get great morning. Get some rest. <clears throat> Wake and make beans and toast. Jesus. Mmm. A bone. Thank you. I'm gonna be ending soon. It's almost fucking 1.30. I just didn't want to, I hate ending at the, like, when someone raids, like, I hate it, like, I hate ending right after someone raids, it's so shitty. A skunk, get him. He's gonna stink me. Say, am I bad? No, it's not your bad. It's not your bad at all. The bees are attacking. It's not your fault.
low. I'm trying to... Fuck. I get it. No, but I appreciate it. I mean, you're not- you don't know that I'm, like, about to end, or that I plan to end, and that I have your tab open, and that I plan to raid you. <laughs> like, you don't know these things. Alright, dog, you're going down. Three, two, one, go! Sorry, pup, you don't have a chance. Oh my god, I danced like that. Excuse me. That bitch didn't- that bitch didn't have a chance. Yeah, I have like a lot- Jimmy, I've been stacking Jimmy, Jimmy. bones and just doing everything in a level as- that's possible. Um, I have one more bone and it's the purple one, I think. So, these animals, these dogs here don't really have much of a chance, but once I get in the other areas where I need, like, fucking 50, I'm really gonna eat shit, and then I'm gonna rage. Um, typical Aubrey behavior. So I'm looking for the purple ones. some Ooh, yeah. Ops, you be good you too Kenneth I'm so excited for you <laughs> like how come you moved and I got happy like I'm sad that you're not in New York anymore because I thought we were gonna, you know, hang out, but it's fucking fine. It's not like you were like my only friend that's close to me that I could hang out with. It's not like you're literally the only person I know that I could fucking like see. <laughs> like, like, it's not like any of that's true. So. <laughs> But no, yeah, I'm gen I'm genuinely happy for you. I'm staying for a while. I work remote. Uh huh. Sure. There's fucking gnats in my room, and I just want to scream and cry. Okay, this is a great place to stop. Um, what did we do in this game? We did the chicken. We did Clarksville. We did the chicken farm. Hello. We did chicken farm, we did big field, and we did farmhouse. So, lit. I will see you guys in the next stream, possibly, maybe. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Ren. Uh, Ren. Ren. Thank you, Ken. There we go. For the raid. There we go. And let's find someone to host real quick. Or raid real quick.